Hey everybody, it's Mark from Tutorial.com and I'm showing you more of what I've worked on with Julian King, the Mandarin Phonics trainer. Uh, so last time uh, I had I showed you the very first version I made of this and everything started off in this, uh, oops, in this uh, soundboard that looked like this. Um, there was no play audio on hover, it just did automatically. So people would move the mouse around and they would just get sounds as they were going. And there were some problems, uh, like sounds were getting, uh, were overlapping or uh, getting things cut off. There, there was some, some basically some timing issues uh, that also had to be ironed out. So it was like a touchy interface. And a lot of people just saw this and they were like, what are all these things? So I added a page basically saying, Bopomofo is the phonetic alphabet for Mandarin. Uh, it's also known as Mandarin phonetic symbols or Julian Fu Hao. Um, and I say like why you might want to learn it. Um, I mentioned uh, that like uh, Pinyin has U mapped to two vowels and also E is mapped to two vowels. Uh, U could be, let me turn off the play on hover. U could be this sound or it could be this sound. E. And in pinion, an E might be this sound. E. Or it could be this sound. E. So uh, that's you know one advantage you might get out of out of doing a chewing fu hao. You can you can clear. E. Oops, you can clearly map the vowels. E. 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 I don't like that one actually. It sounds like he's curling his tongue. Uh, a. But uh, anyway, I've, I've got a got multiple recordings for each one. Um, so after after showing people like what it's for, um, I go to the next page. Uh, uh, ma, fa. And it plays through each of the sounds, and I've set it up so that. Uh, uh, there are keyboard shortcuts for the sounds, and they're the same shortcuts that uh, a Julian input method would have, like if you're using a, a computer in Taiwan, or a computer owned by a Taiwanese person that installed it. Um, so yeah, like here if I hit A, it'll play ma, ma. Um, and so on. It still has like the same play audio on hover option as before. Um, and I, I uh, basically duplicated this page. Da, ta, na, la. For the entire alphabet. And I've got uh, keyboard shortcuts also for navigation, so I can just go through really quickly. Uh. Um, to the very last one. And uh, then a well done page. Uh, and then it sends people to the main soundboard. So this is what I've done. I think it's uh, way the heck better than it was. So I, I doubled the price on Gumroad. Everyone that got it before uh, can can just download the update for free. Um, I think the next step is going to be uh, adding a quizzing feature. Like I think the way this, what would make sense for this is. Buh. Buh. Ma, fa. is after each of these pages uh, it should quiz you it should play the sounds and then you have to hit the appropriate key or click on the appropriate symbol to make the sound before the program will let you go out on the next page and then maybe after doing half the board give you a bigger quiz where you have to recognize like all of those those letters from that half and then uh, another cumulative one once you finish the entire board um, anyway, I would love to hear your thoughts, questions, comments, even criticism is all welcome. Um, just comment here or go to tushua.com and send me an email or tweet at me, tushua uh, at tushua. Thanks, guys.